Have you ever looked at the divorce rates or messy dating pool and wondered why ever step foot into it? Do you hear jaw-dropping tragic love stories that dispel the thought of relationships from your mind? Or are you a hopeless romantic who imagines falling for the perfect person? Yet you wonder what lies beyond the butterfly feelings? In the world of social media and dating apps, dating can be hard to figure out, especially if you haven't discovered who or what you really want. Are there still valid reasons to justify dating culture? If there are, what are they? Disclaimer: This video is based on our personal opinion. Viewers are free to utilize the content at their discretion. Unhealthy reasons people date. Coping mechanism. First and foremost, many people turn to dating as a way to cope with various personal issues. For example, according to a journal on marriage and mental health among young adults, a survey showed that prolonged singleness could trigger low self-esteem. Some people facing these challenges tend to quickly enter relationships as soon as they're available, without getting to know the person first or introspecting why they want to be in a relationship. This impulsive behavior stems from an emotional reaction, driven by the belief that a relationship will solve all their problems. However, in reality, they're using it as a coping mechanism to deal with their struggles. Online appearance. This goes all the way back to the 18th century during the Regency era, when an entire season would be devoted to matchmaking and courtship. Then during courtship, couples would take strolls in public places with the intention of being seen together. While finding love was the end goal of every young man and woman in this process, a considerable influence was to avoid the stigma of being perceived as unweddable. Centuries later, much hasn't changed. Many still feel the pressure to be in a relationship. People often date and use social media to make it seem like they're in a relationship, just to avoid feeling bad about being single. Casual sex. For another category of individuals, the point of dating is no more than to fulfill their sexual desires. This has created a subtype of relationship in the dating scene, popularly known as friends with benefits or hookup culture. In these types of dating, two consenting adults agree that their relationship with one another offers nothing deeper than pleasure. While there are arguments for the self-empowering nature of this type of dating, it doesn't take away the fact that it creates a more significant problem in the world of relationships and society at large. Finding this video interesting, like, share, and subscribe. So what makes dating such a big deal? Healthy reasons to date. Learning. Dating serves as an exciting avenue for learning about people and, most especially, yourself. In dating, you discover things about yourself that you never knew about. You learn about your strengths, weaknesses, boundaries, how you give and receive love, also known as love languages, and the sacrificial nature of love. And you know what's really fun? It is endless because in dating, you're always learning about one another, just when you assume you've known it all. Self-improvement. Human beings are great imitators. We mirror one another without even being conscious of it. A study from Yale University found that if one spouse had quit smoking, taken up running, or begun to consume a healthier diet, their partner became more likely to do it as well. In dating, we allow our light to shine into our partner's darkness, and their light to shine into ours. Longevity. Dating has surprising physiological and psychological health benefits worth embracing. For example, dopamine and oxytocin, the two feel-good hormones that help manage anxiety and stress, are primarily released during committed, loving relationships, directly contributing to an increased lifespan. Marriage. In dating, you and your partner evaluate one another to see if you are willing to stick to one another through thick and thin, to keep each other happy and fulfilled. According to Bumble's current dating trends, young people prioritize emotional intimacy and shared values. This indicates long-term commitment and marriage are significant purposes of dating again. At the end of the day, we live in a free world where everyone has the liberty to live life on their own terms. However, a concept such as dating is not meant to be as obscure and confusing as it has become. Considering these negative and positive motivations for dating can guide you in making the best decisions for yourself as you learn and grow. Did you find this video helpful and want to learn more about the challenges of modern dating? Watch this video now.